project to a wireless display over Ethernet? I have a Roku TV that supports Windows 10's wireless display feature. On my laptop, I'm able to project to it with no problem. Okay, it's actually pretty slow, but the point is that it works, on my Windows 10 desktop, however, I can't connect to it or even get to the same menu. For review, here's how to connect to a wireless display in Windows 10. Open the Action Center, bottom right corner of the Windows 10 desktop. Click on Project, if you don't see this option, you may first have to expand to view all the options, depending on your screen size. Click on Connect to a Wireless Display. Select your desired wireless display. Profit. It's step number three where things fall down. There is no connect to a wireless display option on my desktop. My guess here is that since my desktop is connected to the network via Ethernet, Windows 10 somehow assumes that I won't be able to connect to a wireless display. Apparently I'm not the only one running into this. The same question was asked on the Windows forums, but there haven't been any replies yet. There are dozens of us. Dozens. Is this just a Windows 10 bug or does this wireless display feature use Wi-Fi specifically to connect to the device, rather than connecting to a display on the network? If the answer is the latter, I'm interested to know how it does that because it's not something I'm familiar with. This topic is a little old, but I'll put this here for future questions and for people that are still curious. Windows 10 version 1703 extended the Miracast to Miracast over infrastructure, Ethernet. This URL. So both wireless as well as Ethernet is now supported. Edit. The actual idea of projecting over Ethernet using Windows 10 default support is now definitely supported as seen in the above link Miracast over infrastructure, MICE. MS MICE is a recent feature added into Windows 10 version 1703 to support Miracast over Ethernet. I've not seen the technology being implemented yet however, based on the specs and descriptions it does sound promising. Regarding your question, I'm assuming this would work on newer Windows 10 against the Miracast Wi-Fi Roku device but I don't have a Roku device to test. However, in the specs, they mentioned that the source and sync could either be Ethernet or Wi-Fi, so I'm assuming it's interchangeable. I'm assuming you're thinking of having Ethernet Windows 10 and a Wi-Fi Roku. Reference from MS Mice specification. Enabling MS Mice. I've not tested this feature yet, but I'm following development of LazyCast. LazyCast is a casting system that is compatible with Windows 10 Miracast on Rapi and other Linux systems. I've tested this on my Rapi 4 and my Ubuntu tablet and it works seamlessly as I connected to them as a wireless display, even the keyboard and mouse input works. LazyCast lately has been developing on the MICE support, so if you're interested in trying out MICE, LazyCast could be one source. If your computer's hardware doesn't support WIDI then you can't cast. You will need to get a device that can, for example Chromecast, sender and receiver. You can still stream video files over the network by using a media server like Servio if your TV is smart enough to find your computer, but you can't mirror without Miracast slash WIDI. The technology is actually designed to do it through wireless. Somehow, if your TV is connected to internet with Ethernet cable, you should be able to mirror your screen with a 2.4 GHz wireless connected computer. In most scenarios, I don't know why but 5 GHz wireless connections doesn't reach to your TV via Ethernet cable. If you want to cast your screen to your TV using Ethernet, make sure the computer connected to 2.4 GHz network wireless and also Ethernet plugged. That way, your TV, at least Samsung smart TVs, will be able to catch the connection. P.S. Answer is based on my personal experience, it might not work on a different model TV or with a different router. If you want to support channel, please consider subscribing.